Hey there folks and welcome back for another video. I'm Chris from iLeather.com and today we're going to do a face shaving video and no, I haven't lost my mind uh, because when you see what I'm going to use, you're going to think I've lost my mind. Gillette Fusion. One of the things that I've noticed as I've been using some carts on my head is the carts actually don't perform poorly. So what I'm seeking to find out today is can you get a great shave from a cart razor on your face using traditional methods, traditional soap, and all the rest. So that's what I'm seeking to find out. Now, I'm, am I going to convert to a cart razor and give up all my DEs and SEs? Absolutely not. The blades for these are just too expensive. But what I do want to find out is if what we all tend to say that carts are just crap, they don't do a good job or not, is true or not. Uh, and I'm getting a late start today because I woke up this morning and the stomach was not feeling well. So I had to <laughs> sort of uh, stay near uh, a bathroom, but uh, hopefully we can make it through the shave. Uh, stand by and I'll wet the face and we'll get going. Stay tuned. All right, so today we're gonna use a shaving stick. This is Derby. And you just apply it to your face by wetting it and sort of rubbing it on your face and your beard, especially when you're going against the grain, will pick up soap and then uh, <coughs> keep wetting it, by the way, as necessary. After it picks up soap, we'll take the brush to it and generate uh, a lather. A little more just to make sure we get plenty of soap there because I am using this dopey razor. I'm going to hold my nose and use it and, you know, I don't know. It's been, geez, it's been years since I've used a cart razor um, on my face. Probably seven years. Um, so... We'll see how it goes. I really don't know what to expect. I suspect um, the traditional method, using a decent brush and a decent soap, makes all the difference. And I suspect that I'll be able to get a great shave because I have been with the carts on my head. So it seems logical that it would follow through for my face, but there's no way to really assure that until I try it. The only way I'm going to know is to try it and, uh, you know, maybe you're stuck somewhere, you're traveling, you didn't take your D and you, you got to go pick up a cart. Can you get a great shave? That's the question that I'm trying to ask. And again, getting a late start today. Feeling a little better, but I'm not there yet. I'm sure it will pass. Um, but this morning, boy, I tell you, whew, when I got up and got ready to go to work, I was not feeling too hot, but hopefully... By day's end, we'll be back to full capacity and hitting on all cylinders, which I'm not at the moment. But we still have to shave, and that tends to make me feel better, so that is why I do it. Okay, looks like we're ready to go with our derby shave stick. And here we go with this Gillette Fusion, which is their top-of-the-line razor. I'm going to hold my nose and... Let's see how it goes. Well, that feels pretty good, <laughs> to tell you the truth. Um, feels nice and smooth. Uh, certainly not threatening in any way at all. The blades for these things are just outrageous. I think I paid for this razor plus two blades, it was like 15 bucks. But the blades, when you go to buy them in those packs, are just outrageously expensive. But I must say, that does feel quite smooth. Um, so far, it feels really good on the face. I don't know how many blades are in here, about five or six, I'm not sure. I think five. Uh, does feel like it's doing a good job, I must admit. I'm not here to, you know, <clears throat> just claim that you can only get a shave with um, traditional gear. I mean, that's what I'm going to use on my face, what I'm going to continue to use. But if th this turns out to be a great shave, I'm just going to tell you the truth. Uh, and I got to tell you, that first pass, that, <laughs> that felt really good. It felt really, really comfortable, so... Let's rinse the face. We'll come back for pass two. All right, so pass one. Um, that was actually pretty doggone good and comfortable, to be completely honest. I know 
people aren't going to like hearing that, but the truth is the truth. And that felt pretty good. It felt as good as any DE razor I have. Again, will this make me switch back? Absolutely not. I still enjoy the tradition of using older gear. But um, i tell you what, if you make a good lather and you use traditional method. Now, what I will say is on that one pass, did it get me as good as I would normally get? Absolutely not. But I suspect after using the traditional method of three passes that this is going to be an excellent uh, shave based on that first pass because that felt smooth as all get out. So, uh, not really surprised given how the, fate of the head shaves has been going. They've been very, very smooth. So I'm anxious to try this on my head as well. Um, I'm guessing it will do a great job. I think getting a great shave is, you know, really more about the traditional method where you take your time, you enjoy, you use three passes, you use progressive beard reduction and all the rest. I suspect that makes the biggest difference and why people, you know, when they come to uh, traditional shaving, they're like, I'm never going to use a card again because they stink. I think the method has a lot to do with it. The three passes, the using a good soap, using a brush, exfoliating in the shower and all that stuff, doing prep. I think that probably the soap, you know, the technique, I, you know, and the method, I think, makes all the difference. Um, but we'll see how this shave goes, you know, because we have a, another pass yet to do. And then we'll see how, you know, I can tell you right now, it feels really smooth. With a good soap, this thing just glides. And, you know, the Derby Shave Stick is dirt cheap. It's not the best of soaps, but with this traditional method, um, it actually feels quite good. I, I hate to say it. But it's true, so we'll see how it goes for pass three. Stay tuned. All right, here we go. Pass three. It's been a really nice, smooth shave so far. Um, I, I can't say that I'm surprised. I'd say if I hadn't been shaving my head and using the uh, head blade and the Gillette guard, I'd be surprised. But since those cards have done such a fabulous job of shaving my head, I'm not surprised that this fusion is doing a, a great job on my face. I need a little more soap. Seems I've exhausted my, uh, just not quite enough. So let's try to blow it up a little more here and see if that does me any good. Let's wet the brush a little bit. There we go. Just needed a little more. Um, anyway, can't say I'm surprised, but we'll see. Um, am I ready to switch back to carts? Absolutely and positively not. But do I think I know now that, you know, if I'm traveling somewhere, maybe forget my D, which isn't going to happen. But if it did, as long as I can get a good soap and lather and use my traditional method, I think, you, I think it'd be just fine. But we'll see at the end of this pass, evaluate and feel the face and feel... You know, if it really did a good job or if I get any irritation. Um, this soap is really uh, inexpensive, but it's, it's slick and has done a great job for the shave. So if you've been on the fence about the Derby stick, you know, it's worth trying. Um, it certainly provided more than adequate platform for this fusion <laughs> to uh, glide really effectively on. Again, you know, this is a brand new blade, so you can expect it's going to be pretty doggone good. Now, after three or four shaves, I don't know how this would be, but it feels uh, right now smooth as silk. Um, it's very, very smooth. And you can hear it, you know, getting that, those whiskers as I'm going against the grain there. Um, one thing is for sure, it is quite smooth. 
that I will not deny. It. And that pivot, you know, it's kind of like the one blade. Um, it does make it easy. No sense in lying about it. Um, Derby, this Derby stick still has good residual slickness, as as you can see. I can still, you know, use the razor with no ill effects. And uh, I think. We've gotten a pretty good shave here. I will rinse face. We'll come back and do the post and I'll feel and see, you know, if it got as close as I would like and we'll just find out. Stay tuned. All right, and in comes the magic made by which is Thayer's Witch Hazel. Great stuff, which you see here every day. And uh, after I apply a little on the dome, I want to see how close we got and pretty doggone close, folks. Pretty close, not bad at all. So, here's what I'd say about the Fusion cart, which everybody hates, who's a traditional shaver. It does a good job for what it is. Am I going to switch to a cart? No. But if you're in a bind and you want a nice cart, this certainly does the job. Um, I am a traditional shaver. I like traditional gear. However, I will say this razor does uh, a great job for what it is. Um, I think if you use the traditional method, use a decent soap, a brush, take your time, use three passes, you can get a great shave with this. Uh, I'm going to shave my head with it um, next and see how that goes. Uh, thanks as always for joining me. And again, I know we had to hold our nose while we watched this video, but, um, you know, no reason to lie or fabricate. This did a great job. I have to give it to it. Um, again, it is what it is. Thanks everybody for watching. And until next time, wait. We got aftershave. We've just about skipped our aftershave. Today we're just going to use an inexpensive aftershave, which is really nice booster. Whoa, slap some of this on. And, um, not bad at all. Very little in the way of burning. That's interesting. Usually, um, when I use a D, you know, I don't know if a D's a little rougher perhaps, but get a little more burning. There's almost no burning there. And I think there's alcohol in this. Let me see if I can find the ingredient list yeah I'll cause the second ingredient no burning that's interesting huh. oh well well now we'll wrap it up thanks once again for watching and until next time let's help make the entire world shape great once again